I hope you remember last week there was a lot of hubbub. There was nothing to watch. And I mean, I went to theaters everywhere. There is nothing to watch. Well, this week, we're in for a little surprise. I need you to use your imagination a little bit and wonder what if Batman didn't see his parents get killed? Maybe he was raised by a guy who wouldn't let him get pushed around by bullies. What you get from that is the accountant. I know what you're thinking, Brad. That's not anything to do with Batman. Hold on, the guy's trained like crazy. The guy has an overdeveloped sense of justice. I'm telling you, it's some crazy not DC universe and it's a movie you've got to see. Can our son lead a normal life? Define normal. I know I've been saying that October was a bad month for comics and sci-fi movies. I've been corrected. Mattel has picked up the ball where Paramount dropped it and has brought us a comic book style superhero movie in Max Steel. This is pure sci-fi joy. You gotta watch this kid learn how to be a superhero. I may have to go buy some of these toys because this is a great looking movie. You gotta go see it. Steel now, go turbo! We're gonna round out this week's recommendations with something that if you blink, you're gonna miss it. I know any of you who are truly in geekdom know that back on July 29th, Japan released its third incarnation of Godzilla. It was called Shin Gojira in English. It's Godzilla Resurgence. And I am telling you, it is well worth the wait. But we thought it was never gonna come. But you know what? It's in town. It's been in town since Tuesday. And you know what? You have until next Tuesday to go see it. This is Godzilla. And we're talking serious, super CGI'd, angry as hell Godzilla. Don't wait for it on DVD. See it in the theater. We'll see you next time.